The goal to catch a meal because nothing's open, it's Easter Sunday and we have no food. <laughs> It's a little chilly. Well, we're not even using mono. Nipply. It's not even kitchen in there, girl. What? You gotta put mono on there. I couldn't get it on. <laughs> You're gonna bite that. <laughs> Apparently, we were fishing blue. wrong the other day. No, they won't bite blue. Is everybody on? That's not true. It's definitely true. Everybody can catch those Spanish mackies, and I catch tons of them. Guess we'll find out today. you a question. <laughs> Get it?
Would you consider him little? No? He's a little bit bigger. Hey! Kuda! Wow, there's a whole bunch of them. Good job, babe. Is this one too little? Oh, Sean's got one too. Hey! All the barracuda today. Yeah, you barracuda. Are these too small, Sean? Look at this guy just stare at you like, hey, put my brother back in the water. I don't want to get bit. Ooh, that's a good size one. Look at that one. Can I get those pliers? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Good idea. That was close. Let some line out, baby. Yeah, you're pulling it up, so just keep pulling it until it comes off. What? Oh, well. So if you don't know what's happening, the line got stuck on a nail in the beam and the lure is just dangling below it. And for those of you that haven't fished in the Bahamas, it's very difficult to get lures here. And so when you lose one, it kind of sucks. So let's see what happens here. Are you going after it? That is a yes. Okay. Okay. I feel like this should have been done a different way, but okay. Can you see it before you go all the way in? I can't open my eyes under there. Anybody see anything shiny? Oh, it's gonna happen. We were trying to catch more so that we'd have a meal, but but and I got hooked on a nail, which is really unfortunate. Shit happens. I'm like I see something silver. I was hoping the lure would float and I could just grab it. That was not the case. First, so this, this is a barracuda. What we're learning is one, you get these big fat chunks of meat, but two, there's definitely some 
big bones right there. And I don't know, I think they go this whole distance. It, I think we create like the tenderloin and then the, the bottom part. of the filet, yeah. What'd you call it? Side part. Side part? I thought you knew an official term be like side part. <laughs> no. <laughs> the official uh, side part. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> These guys have pretty thin skin, so sometimes it's kind of a pain in the butt. So far, so good. As thin as macro, because that's no. a real pain in the butt. Not nearly that thin. Just taking my time because we only caught one. And we can't waste any. Not that I would waste any anyways on purpose. It's tough fishing out there, you know? It is tough fishing out there. I bet you I casted 400,000 times to get this one catch keeper fish. There's a lot of people that say you can't eat barracuda because they're poisonous. But what we're hearing is the big ones build up this weird sea letter poison. But it's the same in like giant grouper and stuff like that. But these small ones, the locals tell us, eat them up. Eat them up. Some locals won't eat them. Oh boy. But I'm sure we're fine. Snuckle peas and it is delicious. Don't look at my hair. Put a little brain on those ones. 